What's up everyone, this is Ezio Travel unboxing a Canon G7X Mark III for the very first time. And the reason I've actually bought this camera is because it's portable, it's got a headphone jack, 4K, it's got HDR, it's got Wi-Fi on there. There's a lot of features that are in this camera that made me buy this camera. It's quite, it's quite a new processor in there, Digic 8. If you're starting a YouTube channel, vlogging, or travel vlogger, you could actually sort of use this camera and tour well, wherever you want to go. Depends on what you want to use it for. So basically, I have actually bought it because I went to Sri Lanka recently and uh, I took my Canon EOS R there. It was a mirrorless camera, but to carry it around is a little bit heavier. But I didn't really notice the weight. It is a great camera. I wouldn't really downgrade this camera because it's one of my favorite cameras. That's what I'm using right now. I'm filming with. I wanted to, I was tired basically, and I wanted to sort of film my story. I couldn't bother taking my camera out. I put it back in a bag. So I used the G7X Mark II for some of the scenes, not all of them. When I got out of the airport, there was a, basically I was so tired, 13 hours flight, you couldn't really bother to film. So I just took the G7X Mark two out and I filmed with it. Basically that was my wife's camera, so I was using it. When she was tired, she said, oh, I can't bother filming. I go, I'll make the, you know, use of it. It was just in her bag. I just, we should just take it out. So that's the, another uh, good feature about this camera. It's small, portable, 4K, it does nine minutes and 59 seconds, just about 10 minutes. But yeah, just uh, that's the, the reason was 4K for me because I'm actually filming most of my vlogs, my even Tetra Ezio, my gaming channel, I'm, I'm making unboxing videos, so I will be shooting in 4K. So that's the reason I actually bought this camera. All right, this is the camera. This is the Canon G7X Mark III. It's beautiful. <laughs> we could go through it and have a look at it. It's, it's just got a lot of features that, you know, I was impressed with, really. Digic 8. And it's got HDR, which I don't know if I'm going to use it, but I know some of you guys will. Probably, it, it depends what you're going to use it for. But one thing is just get a screen protector for the screen. In certain conditions, certain countries, there could be dust. There, you know, it depends what you're doing. So you could scratch it or, you know, break the screen. It's really fragile. All right, let's go straight to the unboxing. All right, guys, let's go and unbox this PowerSwap G7X Mark III. Let's see what's inside the, well, around the box anyway. It's a Digic 8 uh, processor, 1.0 type, uh, 20.1 megapixels, 24 wide angle, and 1.8 aperture, LCD, 4K, RAW, and JPEG which is great news, you know, especially when you're editing in 4K and especially with RAW, you can have a lot of features and the picture quality is even better anyway. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth. All right, let's go and unbox this beautiful camera. All right, how do I open it? All right, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Booklet, which I never read anyway. I just, if I need to look, I just look on internet or YouTube or any other features, but you can read this if you want to. I know no one really reads them. All right, we come with a, a lead. It's a bit short, hold on. Yeah, it looks short, especially a charging lead. But the charger itself, all right. Uh, it comes with a battery, but my advice is just get a, another a battery that you could use because the batteries will die really, really quick, especially if you're using 4K. All right, what else we got? We got like a, a ribbon. I don't know about that, but I'll probably put it on a... Yeah, I'll probably put it on the Gorilla Pod. Well, I've got the black version. I know there's a silver one, so that's the camera right there. You can see it. There. All right, uh, well, my advice is get a, my advice is get a basically a screen protector. 
because you would end up damaging it you know if you're like using it a lot especially if you're like you know putting it in your bag straight away HDMI port or something like this and then you can connect it I guess it's USB-C I think it is yeah maybe it should be okay yeah this is the key feature that you really want in a camera a mic that's the reason I actually sold my Canon G7X Mark II because I'm an audio guy I like audio really crisp and sharp I'm, I'm a bit fussy about that and uh, yeah so with this bonus you could attach a, a mic well I know there's no if you want to put a mic on this camera you probably might need to you know there's no room to put it I will explain about what sort of um, things you could put on your camera and uh, what sort of accessories to buy all right that's about it I set the time and date uh, okay first of the first that's 29 that's not correct uh, what day is it today is the first today first of the second okay, hold on how do I do it yeah, that's all right that's a UK star date by the way uh, how do I change it okay here we go uh, yeah that's fine first of the two 2020 date time zone well, I'll leave the time I'll set that later on best thing to do is get a big memory card especially if you want to shoot 4k and larger files especially jpeg and stuff so recommended 128 gb all right let's go and put the memory card in uh, let's just off that one and put it in there yes yeah, it's, it's a bit weird you know where you have to put the memory card in <laughs> especially now i keep forgetting because i'm used to the mirrorless cameras on the side okay there we go one thing is if you want to attach um, anything, the wireless, uh, road, or any road pros, you should get one of this bracket. This is this is the UU Rig R06, R016. But well, this is it. This is the bracket that you should normally get for this camera. But I'm, I'm I'm pretty aware that all of you would actually get this one. So there's the clip there where you could hook um, any sort of device especially if, you, if you've got the road wireless go that's perfect for it i would actually get that one is well you get a seven hours battery on there but what i'm using for this camera it is what i'm gonna be using for this camera i'm gonna be using a road micro and let's try this out this is 4k and this is the mic i'm using the camera is brilliant iso is set to auto if you can see this uh yep yeah. yeah brilliant it is it's actually tracking it quite good where I can see it. I will test the mic out and use the basic mic that is built in. Have a look at the difference. Now this is set to auto. If you can see the difference, there's a lot of noise and everything. Yeah, it's brilliant. But I will test it out once I get it on the computer and render the files. Well, I'll just have a bit more. Yeah, the camera is really really good it catches everything fine and quite spot on personally the more you use this camera the more better you get it there's a lot of features that you could uh, click and also there's quite a few dials here record button menus uh info you never know you know you could be a professional with it but the features are really really good especially 4k you're shooting in uh 1080p is really really brilliant yeah quite a good travel camera to have especially if you're new to vlogging or any other channel you could still use it even some professionals are using this canon g7x is mark ii still so this is the Mark III, this is the higher step up in the ranking. And I hope you guys actually enjoyed this unboxing video. And please, you know, don't forget to like, subscribe and leave your lovely comments behind. If there's anything else 
that you want me to do make a video about please leave your comments below and i should get back to you so thanks guys for watching and hope to see you in my next video thanks